So we have a warm day here in New England. It's almost 60 degrees and one of the hives is active. I went in there earlier today and cleaned out some of the different um, scraps from inside the top of the hive. And what I'm going to do is uh, put some honeycomb, which is left over for food. I don't know if you can see that. And I've got a little bit of sugar sprinkled on that. So we're going to go over to the uh, one active hive and put that in there. And I'm going to videotape it uh, for you to see. And what I'm going to do is switch the video around. So here's one of the hives. You can see the bees coming in and out. And they're pretty active, uh, which is a really good sign. And what I'm going to do is lift the top and put this honeycomb in there for them. This is a hard time of year where it starts warming up, but there's no flowers growing yet, so they need a source of food and the honey and the sugar. And pretty soon, bee patties, which are, it's a pollen patty, um, it's manufactured. Uh, we place that inside the hive so the bees can survive until the flowers start budding and they can get their pollen. So right here is the top cover, and I have a propolis cover inside, which I like to have on my hives because it allows me to lift the top and not disturb the bees. I can't come charging out at me when I lift the top, which is a good thing. Um, so we're going to do this uh, hopefully in a quick and easy um, one move. So I'm going to put the phone down while I do this, just so I can get in and out of there really quick. So what I did was place the container of honey and honeycomb and sugar down inside uh, the hive on top of the, actually the second layer of frames and then there's an empty box. This box here is empty and that's where I put the food and the water, the sugar water and the pollen patty when it's time for the pollen patty. So the bees have space to eat the food that I just put in there for them, which is, you can see down inside there uh, in the little plastic container. So I put the uh, top cover back on and you can see the plastic um, propolis trap up on top. So the hive sits on top of that. The girls weren't too happy about me taking the top off their hive, so Hopefully they'll find their honeycomb and start eating that. They were eating the sugar that was in there uh, earlier this morning, so I know that they'll definitely eat the honey because that's a preferable food source for them. And you can see them coming in and out. They are cleaning out the hive and all the debris out. trying probably to search for some pollen, but there is none right now, so the word will get out that there's food inside the hive, so they don't have to eat their honey reserves, and they need to be able to keep feeding the queen so she can continue to lay eggs and make the hive bigger.